and I hope that Kumon will not be arrested. Because <laughs> every time he's on press or to Nashika Shikae, Wanashika Maina Jenga, that is going to stop. I left this country for Qatar. From Qatar, I went to San Francisco. That was 15 hours flight. From there, I went to Phoenix. From Phoenix, I went to uh, Jamaica, where I was for two days at the invitation of Richie Spice. And then from Jamaica, I went to uh, San Francisco. From San Francisco, I went to Hawaii, Maui. Then from Maui, I came back to London. I spent two days in London, and then I'm here. So the journey was very okay. And I'm so glad with what the media is doing in this country. The fourth estate, you are the only people who are making sense because you are bringing issues. And to people like um, Eric Omondi, Eric Omondi has become the new kingpin, the new kingpin of our generation, your generation. Mine is a bit backward. And it's this kind of people that we need to hand over power because we have had a lot of uh, uh, same people, same hegemony from independence. Ni hao hao tu, kila wakati, hao ndi watalete maendeleo. Kila wakati ni hao. Hala saizi ukiwana hizo mesa zote zimejaa, ni hao tu. We need to replace them. But much gratitude goes to Raila Molodinga for having been very consistent, consistent. His mind is fresh, his ideas are fresh. It's only that every time he stands for election, they steal his election. They steal Raila's election every time. And I'm also thankful to the Republic of Niger. I'm very glad that Niger, uh, Mali, um, Gabon, and uh, Burkina Faso has brought in a new trend of politics. I thank the Russians. I thank the Russians and the Chinese. I didn't like the Chinese before, but I think I'm going to make uh, some kind of inroads. The transitional period in African politics is what we need. We are tired of the same goons same people, same. Why would you be arresting a young man like this one who has never even stolen chicken? Kila wakati Eric Omondi akisimama, munashika e, munapiga e. The constitution guarantees his liberties. People like Maina Jenga, you've arrested this man, umepereka e kotini, bado natuma police kwenda kushika e. Now they are here listening, the NSIS. I'm telling you, your time, is, your time has come. You should know that you are frustrating your own country people. And Raila Amolodinga, we need to make sure that our barber is not reflective of the old generic generation. Baba's mind is very fresh, like in Kunawatu and Amtumia. Kunawatu and Amtumia, Baba Asalada. Already they are planning Baba's transition before he dies. Kunawatu Pale and Ataka, who is Baba going to support? Eh? Wako Pale too, because one attacker or Ingia Kamguya Baba. How do you inherit ODM? We are your mama, ya Baba. Leave alone, uh, Mamaida. Why do you want now to come in? And we are going to reveal this when the right time comes. Those goons who are sitting around Baba, Wajan Wambia, your time is up. We have the likes of Eric Omondi, who actually can help Baba. And for the MP, the, the, the MP who has, who has actually been, uh, those MPs who have been kicked out of ODM, who are resigned Leo, Namimi to support Eric Omondi for Langata. Does it mean that you've joined him uh, to push about the revolution? Well, Eric Omondi is doing what we have been doing. Eric Omondi is doing what Baba has been doing. Mm. If we say that we join Eric, we shall be insulting Baba. Yes. We are doing what Eric Baba joining. has set, and now Eric is taking joining. the right path. Mm. And that's why the Rail Odinga family loves Eric, because they can see he's a young blood, he's young blood. He's a, a, a go-getter. He fears nothing. How many times have they arrested this young man? And whenever they arrest him, they torture him, they put him in Land Rovers. Why in modern Kenya? Why are we having this dictatorial, dictatorial regime kind of uh, agitation? Why, what's wrong with Ruto's government? We thought we left these things a long time ago. Uh, the other day, Gashago was being arrested. Yes, that was wrong. He was taken to court. Yes, he went to defend himself. Now, <laughs> Mayana Jenga was arrested. And outside there, they are still arresting him, beating him up, torturing him. And then the same, same Gachagua, 
has flown to Colombia, wherever it was. Was it Colombia or, uh, well, yeah. Has he seen how things work there? Why do you put police on the streets? I was a policeman, so what? Why do you use the police? Why do you ban people like me from going to Mount Kenya? You're just spreading my message. If I run for election today, Baba is still alive, but I'm just saying, supposing I was to run for president, me and Gashagwa, I'll defeat him in Mount Kenya very early in the morning because he's interfering with my supporters. He's telling people not to work with me. Now, uko America na tembea na ma president, uko Jamaica na pewa red carpet. Eh? When I go to the, to the UK, I'm given red carpet. It's only in this country where I've got people who have no moral hygiene. Hawana moral hygiene, hawana morality. I think when Gashago was a district officer, I was an intelligence officer. And of course, the mentality of district officers, because if somebody can come from there and behave the way this man is behaving, look at what is happening between them and Moses Kuria. Moses Kuria is insane. Why do you tell Kenyans, Kwenda Ujimbe Ni, your own rail, and he's still a cabinet secretary and the president has not said anything? Why should Gachagua say that we have uh, uh, tigers in Kenya? Lying! A whole man, like if he was in the US, he should, be, have, he should have been uh, impeached. I want Gachagua to resign for telling lies about this country. I want Moses Kuria to go yesterday. I want Ndindi Nyoro Kwenda Kabisa. Eh, tunataka hii watu wakwende wakwende wanatusumbua nini sasa angalia hii mazungumzo kila siku namna hii namna hii na kuna wale betrayers wa baba tumewajua wanakaa tu karibu na baba wakichukua tu vitu hivi Raila is a very smart man he knows what is going on why would we why should we be having this monolithic mongoose eh? watu ambao <laughs> banana akili yao imeenda mbinguni sijui kwa shetani huko As we speak, Maputa in and I read somewhere, it in Kupanda. As a leader, what are your views on that? I think the people who elected these people should face the route. As Eric said recently, because if you go to Uganda, how much is a litre of petrol? Uganda, and then they import oil from Kenya, through Kenya, pipeline, taxes, kila kitu, na oil yao iko chini. Tanzania pia iko namna hivyo. I love Kenya and Nayenda hivyo. The other day we made some kind of demonstration wakarudisha wakarudisha kidogo. Wale watu wa EPZ, those stupid clerks in EPZ, where do they get the monotony or monopoly of increasing prices of fuel? Who gives them that that order? Wanasema tu war order. Imeenda hivi na tumeletea tupikipiki twingine juzi at electric. Hiyo zitaenda wapi? Let this government stop mocking with the with the people of this republic. Look at what is happening in West Africa. It is coming here very soon. I don't know what we should do. And that's why I'm welcoming the Russians and the Chinese. For the first time, um, colonial mentality. What okay? Why is BP, why, why are the French companies, the French companies, the owners of Total, not talking about it? Why are the French exploiting everywhere they go? I'm also asking the French to leave this country. We have had enough of them. We are talking our end kabisa. And if they don't go, time will come when we shall go and remove them forcefully. Okay. Professor, uh, recently you said in a statement that President Ruto is running the government in a pata potea manner. Do you think he has the skills to run this government? Not at all. He has failed. If I was the president, I'll take it easy like Kibaki. I'll make things run. When you go and take people who are not qualified to, to help you run the government, eh? Alisema Mama Mboga, Kuna mama mboga kwa hiyo cabinet, labda ni Alice, Alice anaitua oh, Alice, kwa hume huyo ndiyo mama mboga yaki. Alianda kasema sijui boda boda, hey, ndindi nyoro ndiyo boda boda pale. So, watu kama hao, what do you expect? People who cannot reason, people who have never seen anything, people who have no experience. That's why we like the cabinet, we like the constitution to be changed, so that cabinet secretaries should be... Uh, Appointed through parliament, from parliament, they are answerable. Like you know, if you go to Varanga, you can come out. They have become billionaires. Look at Murukomen. Murukomen is wearing a watch. Muliona Juzi. How many millions? Where did he get that money from? What is happening with the parastatals? What is happening with the employment in this country? Is Kalanjins one side? Kikuyu is the other side. Is that incitement? Let us do the audit and find out people have been appointed, even in parastatals.
wakitaka serikali yao wakae nayo it's time we demarcate this country the constitution allows us to hold a referendum so that we can have a state within ourselves self determination and i echo the words of mwangi wairia some of us are very experienced very educated we advise other governments outside when we come in our own country we are relegated alafu wanataka menibia kura because i go 2.8 million wakaiba wakaiba alafu nataka mimi niende nil before ruto niombe kazi am i crazy gentlemen of the press i have principles and i go by them and that's why i like this young man eric eric's principle has attracted babas has attracted me and as me your leadership we are looking at him and saying now let us unite as a team and put him up there as one candidate formidable candidate instead of putting this candidate that candidate we want to put eric komondi na hiyo itaingia